Hello, I want to show you how to make um, two, or you're going to be making one, clay emoji. These are hollow spheres made out of clay. Okay, so materials that you're going to need, you're going to need two chunks of clay. You are going to need the tools. And in your tools, I have for you, these are both loop tools. They're used um, to carve away the clay. You're also going to need the water bottle. This is going to act like slip. Slip is the glue that holds clay together when you put two pieces of clay together. You will need um, a wooden tool with a point. There's a couple different knives in here, and there's also a popsicle stick, okay? So the first thing you're going to do is to roll your clay in your hands or on the surface of your canvas mat. Okay, we are going to make something called a pinch pot. Okay, so when you have a pinch pot, you push your thumb into the center of the ball of clay. I'm going to use this kind of a motion with my fingers. Only my thumb will be inside of the pinch pot. Only my thumb is in there. And I'm making this kind of a motion as I turn it. Don't do it on the table. Always do it in your hand. So I'm going to start turning. And this is it right there. I want the wall the rim of my pinch pot or the wall of my pinch pot to be as thick as my finger, okay? Don't make it very thin. Make it about as thick as your finger. If I look at this side of it, it looks like a half of a circle, okay? I'm going to do this one more time, making another pinch pot. Okay, I'm going to put my thumb into the middle. I'm going to push down. I'm going to work in this type of a motion. And I'm going to make the thickness of the wall about as thick as my finger. Okay, now I have made two pinch pots that are about the same. Okay, now we're going to join these together so they are like a sphere. The first thing I need to do when I join two pieces of clay together is to score. Um, where is that one? Score. Score means I rough up the surface of my clay that I'm going to put together. So use your wooden tool and you're going to go along and you're going to rough up the surface of your clay or score. Do this to both rims of the pinch pot. Okay, next thing I need to do is I need to add water to my pinch pot rims. This is like slip. Slip is like the glue that holds clay together. Today we're using water. 
spray the rim of your pinch pot, only do one. Then you're going to take your two pinch pots, push them together and kind of wiggle it back and forth a little bit. Apply a little bit of pressure. Okay, I have them together. Now I'm going to take my thumb and I'm going to go across my seam and I'm going to smooth that join out. I'm going to work from one side and the other side. I want to get rid of my seams so I cannot see that join anymore. Okay, so it does not look like a sphere yet. Now what I need to do is I'm going to hold it in my hand and with my other hand, I'm going to very gently pat it and turn it to shape it into a sphere. I am also going to roll it on my canvas mat. Okay, now I'm going to take some water. I'm going to spray the surface just a little bit and I'm going to smooth out any of those flaws in the surface. I want it nice and smooth. Be careful not to put too much water on your clay. It can get too soft and it can collapse. I can push the clay to any spots that I want to fix. It's going to be really sticky to work with at first. If your clay gets too wet and too sticky, you can roll it on your canvas mat. Okay, and you've made a clay sphere.